everybody, and happy Sabbath. I hope you're having a very beautiful and blessed day today. So I wanted to show you a few things. Uh, I had a birthday this week. It was on Wednesday, and it was probably the best day I had. I got balloons from some friends, and uh, chocolate was attached to the balloons. Very nice. Um, I got more chocolate from a different friend. A whole box worth. Ooh la la, so yummy. And then I got really, really pretty flowers. And I got a bunch of other smaller gifts from family and other friends. And it was just a marvelous and wonderful and loved filled day. Oh, it just made me so happy. Hmm. It was a good day. Oh, I was just I, I had such a wonderful time and I felt truly, truly loved. And that's how you should feel on your birthday because you are a loved person, no doubt. But there are times where I've had birthdays where I haven't gotten much. Maybe a couple cards and maybe a flower, but that was it. It wasn't all that big of a deal. It was kind of a ho-hum day. Hmm, kind of sad, but at least somebody remembered me with cards. That was a good thing. So there are times where I was in plenty, like this birthday. Oh, I had so many gifts and visitors and flowers and balloons and chocolate. Chocolate is very important for me. Mm-hmm, yummy. But there are times where I hadn't had much. And those were kind of sad birthdays. You know, speaking of having good birthdays and so-so birthdays, it kind of reminds me of a Bible verse. You want to hear it? Well, I'm sure you do. <laughs> it comes from Philippians 4, verse 12 and 13. And it says, I have learned the secret of being content in any and every situation, whether well-fed or hungry, whether living in plenty or in want. For I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. So whether we have much, whether we have little, we should always remember that it is Christ who gives us strength. And it is also Christ who provides for us. And that is such a beautiful and wonderful blessing. So I want you to know that Christ loves you and he will give you the strength that you need to get through today, tomorrow, and any day that you need him. Because he is our Heavenly Father. And there is a hotline that you can call him 24-7 and it's called prayer. So if you need to talk to your Heavenly Father about anything that is on your heart or burdening, burdening you, He is more than happy to hear from you. So give Him a call today. Remember that Christ supplies all our needs, whether we are in want or have much, or in, in any sort of situation that we're in, He will provide for you. Have a beautiful and blessed Sabbath. Bye-bye.